Neighbors say the dog involved in this morning's attack was a three-year-old Rottweiler named Rocky. He had so many chains and they're, they're all just ripped in half now. Maya Turner's mom is the person who actually found Rocky and gave him to the next door neighbor. That was a few years ago. While nice at first, she says she witnessed a change in the dog, especially after he was hit by a bicyclist. He saw the 13 year old kid come running playing Pokemon Go. He thought it was trying to threaten him, so he broke this 600 pound chain and like tackled him to the floor and bit him on the back. Three attacks and three people hurt later. Animal control tried taking Rocky this morning. That is when he grabbed onto this officer, Rick Alva. Witnesses say the 100 pound creature would not let go, severely puncturing Alva's arm and sending the animal control veteran into emergency surgery. And he's gonna be out for an indefinite amount of time. So this is a hurt not only for us as an agency, but it's a hurt really for the community. This case raising a really a pressing question tonight. Why did it take three different incidents before Rocky was deemed vicious. Animal control tells me dog biting cases, they're not actually as clear cut as you may think. In order for a dog to be considered vicious, several things must first be considered. Was this dog at large? Was this dog provoked in any way, shape, or form? Um, was, the, was there any way for the dog to be restrained by someone? Despite three attacks, Animal Control says Rocky's situation was different each time. Tonight, Officer Alva is out of surgery and is in stable condition. It is not yet known if he will be able to return to full-time duty.